Just <laughs> shut up! Okay, we're good. We're good. Okay. Let's do this. I have to take cap. <laughs> I need to go. Okay. Hey, everyone. This is the Power Fruit Podcast. It's going to consist of mostly video game chatter. The occasional <laughs> random Kit Kat eating. And um, maybe it's a random video. Or movie talk. Or kind of thing. So it's split up into three segments. Um, first one's gonna be like what the four of us have played this week. Just going through saying I played this, what it was, how it was, that, stuff like that. Part two is gonna be like we're gonna review a game. Um, you guys will figure it out what game we're reviewing when we get there. And part three is pretty much just like free casting. So pretty much we're just gonna talk about video games and we're gonna go on tangents and talk about. Um, anything, Lama anything. Kings, really. hairy legs, <laughs> and we'll go from there. So I am a Jedi owner. I'm always dancing. I'm Lama King, and I'm Arclight. And yeah, so that's everybody. Um, dancing and I have YouTube channels, and Arclight, if you make actual videos on Spin Te- Jumble Bat, technically a part of it still. Kind of, yeah. I have like a two percent share. Yeah. There's reminiscence of you. Yeah, he's made three videos of... Um, three out of 153. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay, yeah. I'm that three at the end. Good for you. That's me. Okay, and Alan King just fucking trolls videos on YouTube watching every video game out there. I actually have a life. Like you what? walk everywhere. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> We're getting the library. <laughs> we get exercise. Good for you. See, I, I sit on the chair right there and I just play video games all day. I go to work. So, Still alive. <laughs> Better than yours. <laughs> I don't think so. I think it's actually playing video games. I do too. <laughs> oh, that like Uncharted, eh? Yeah. Okay, okay. Like well, Uncharted. Uncharted is we'll, awesome. We'll, we'll, we'll let Arclight start off with what he's played this week. All I've really paid, played is LOL. That's it. LOL. And League LOL. of Legends, for those of you who don't know. Yeah, I just got him into the game, so. He's new. He's a noob. He no, feeds. I was just ki- kidding. I do not feed. You fed once. Okay, I fed once, but that Well, at least once that I know of. What okay, is, once. What does feeding mean to the people who don't know it? Dying lots. <laughs> Giving the team lots of extra points. Yeah. Dying lots. So he's pretty much an idiot. Shitting the bed. You, yeah, not shitting on my bed. I don't want to shit on your bed. You better not shit on my bed. I won't shit on your bed. Well, you, tell us your first experience about WoW. Well. well, I did really, really well in my first game. I think it went six and two. You went mean two and six. No, two, six and two. Two and six. Six and two. So you went, you went. Okay, go on. I played as the ninja, Shen. Shen. Because he's a ninja. Yeah, he's also a new player. No, he's a ninja. Okay, go on. I'll stop interrupting you. I'm sorry. Being an asshole right now. You know you can keep you can keep going. That's what I said. I'm gonna get that you just keep going right here. Yeah, I know. It was very special because I played Dota and Han and all that jazz, and it's it's similar but it's different. That makes no sense, but it's similar enough. Yes. But it's got added stuff that makes it better, like summoner spells and runes, I guess. But I haven't bought any or used them. I have no idea how because somebody hasn't taught me. Shop. You it's click runes, and then you buy them. <laughs> it's called the internet. There's really nothing Just hard about that. Just fucking Google it dot com. I don't want to Google it. That's too easy. Oh. I go to Yahoo. <laughs> no I one uses Yahoo. Fucking bling it. I don't want to bing it. You mean bing it. <laughs> <laughs> bling it. <laughs> I, I got some gold teeth, guys. I'm a fucking gold ninja. Look at me. What, what, what attracts you to low? Me? <laughs> Dancing did. He just attracted me right in there. She said. Aw, uh, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Is that all you played? Yeah, really, that's all I've played. That's I all I've played. That's, <laughs> I haven't had time to do anything else. Right. Because it's too damn cold in the basement. Whoa. What? <laughs> wear a bunny hug. Wear a bunny hug. I don't want to wear a bunny hug. Or go outside. I don't want to go. Can I bring my laptop outside? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what? I don't know. Is it gonna like burn in the sun? Yeah, you know, laptops it's a laptop. are meant to be portable. It's a Toshiba. Right? It's still a laptop. It can't do fuck all. <laughs> if it can play League of Legends, it can obviously do fuck something. Dude, my my laptop can play League of Legends. Yeah, exactly. And 
But I think Jedi's is worse shit. than the Dark Blade. Mine's a piece of shit. But it's a Toshiba. Mine's a Dell. It's not much better. Yeah, Dell's worse. Dell's worse. <laughs> Toshiba Dell. Asus. Yeah. <laughs> Asus. Mm-hmm. No name brand. There's a no name brand computer? Yeah. It's like PC? <laughs> President's Choice PC. Oh my god. That would suck. PC PC? Okay, so Lama King, what have you been playing? Uncharted 2. That's it? Uh, yeah. yeah. Talk, talk to us about some, some Uncharted. Yeah. <laughs> it's just really awesome. Why is it awesome? You're so vague with your, with your answers. Nolan like North. Yes. Who is Nolan North? The best voice actor in gaming? Yes. Except for Dark Void. We're just going to forget about that one. Yes. <laughs> Can you keep going? Why, yeah. What do you like about Uncharted? You can't just see this. Just keep going. That I am not good at. <laughs> It's better than so Tomb Raider finished, because man. I don't stare at her ass the whole time. Though the new one might be. The new one might be better. We'll wait and see. I'm still going to stare at her ass the whole time. <laughs> what? Tomb Raider. Oh. Nah. <laughs> Just I really been a fan shots. of the Tomb Raider games. Well, the new one might be different, which is why I'm actually interested in it for once. So they're going to put her in really baggy clothing? Rather than short shorts all the time. No, the idea behind the, this one is they're actually giving her character. So smaller tits. A realistic Essentially. <laughs> she doesn't leave a fucking fucking Barbie doll anymore. Well, you couldn't climb like that if you had giant tits. You just fall over. Or you could use them to like hop onto ledges. Boy, like, and see, she's not, she doesn't have to swim. <laughs> that makes more sense. That's how she stays afloat for so long. <laughs> oh yeah, Jedi. What about you? What have you been playing? Um, I beat Marvel Ultimate Alliance 2 last night. Okay, <laughs> okay, I'm not going to trench quite yet, guys. Spider-Man. Okay. Trench. Just because my games don't change very much weekly to weekly. You never finish me. anything. Hey, I finished, <laughs> I finished Marvel Ultimate Alliance 2. After how many months? Six. There you go. Anyways, it was good. Um, if you can get it for cheap, I definitely recommend playing it. Much better with friends, so if you can get it's up to four percent co op through Xbox I think it's just two for a console, but I no, I think it's four it's for It's four. It is four, I'm sorry. It is four. Deadpool, Deadpool, Deadpool. Deadpool's a fake. No I use Deadpool and he sucked, so I switched him out for fucking penance. And I don't penance know. Penance is overpowered. So you cheated. No, you okay, can't maybe, but <laughs> I use him and Thor and Venom and Wolverine to kill the final boss. Okay, Venom, Wolverine, good choice. Yeah. Which version of Thor is it? Is the one where he has the stupid wing hat, or is it like the bearded dude? Um, he started with the bearded dude, and then I got his costume, and he had, he had the wingy hat. I hate the wingy so hat. I gave him the yeah, the wingy hat. hat looks pretty, pretty fun. Yeah, the graphics aren't that good. I didn't figure that out. But it was fun. Definitely recommend people. Just go try it. I don't think there's a demo for it. Did you do for or against registration? I went against registration because I don't want to register. I don't want to be like, hey man, look at me. I am fucking like Bruce Banner. I'm the Hulk. Look at me. No. I went for registration because I like Iron Man. Iron Man's, Iron a, Man's a bitch. Yeah, <laughs> he's, he's, he's a powder ass so bitch. True. He's so not true. a bitch. He's Robert Downey Jr. No. What? No. He's Tony Stark. But he's also Bro- Robert Downey Jr. Play is Tony Stark. Yeah. It's Robert Downey Jr. <laughs> oh my god. You are a fucking new. I like Robert Downey Jr. Yeah. No, it's really fun much. to say. <laughs> Mike is has down. E. Syndrome of a down? No. <laughs> no. Um. Okay, now there's this buzzkill. So yeah, um. Actually, just go pick up the first one. It's pretty much the same thing as the first one. You get the first one cheaper. Yeah, but you get those fusion lines. kills. Honestly, I, I, thought, I thought the first one had a better story than the second one. Stories just confuse me. The, s- the second one was just like, blam, Act 1 is completely different than Act 2 for story, and Act 2 is completely different than fucking Act 3. Completely well, they do have to progress stories. the story. Yeah, but there's sudden jumps in the story. Like, just All of a sudden, it's just like, okay, that, that was a spoiler, but like, pro against registration, I'm just having like a normal battling bad guys that are prone against superhero registration. 
Octopus in this final thing. And it's like, well, okay. What happened in the middle? Yeah, okay, the middle was pro and against registration to just follow their superheroes. Whatever, but... I mean, I don't know. I definitely picked up the first one. The first one was a lot better. And you can get it for like probably like five bucks. Even yeah. ten even like ten bucks with four is a two with it. Four is a two is fucking <laughs> Such amazing. A good deal. I've been playing four is a two a lot too. I'm level like forty one. And I'm fucking awesome at that game. Well, not really, but I love the game. I'm not gonna go into it because it's just a racing game. Um, Realistic racing game. Yeah, simulation. Like sim, yeah, sim. It's hard. Driving an Audi R eight, fucking awesome. And a nineteen seventy Dallas Challenger R T Hemi. Nice. But anyways, I get away from my fours to talk, and, um... I'd <laughs> rather play Blur. I like Blur. Yeah. Blur. I like games, hard yeah. games that are about crashing, because I cannot drive worth their shit, so the games I'm good at is Burnout. I love that game. <laughs> if it involves crashing, I'll be good at driving for some You'd reason. You'd like Split Second. Yeah, you would, lo- you would love Split Second. I probably would. Game. Or Motor it's like Storm. Realistic. Motor Storm you would love. Motor Storm's awesome. Just get dirt. Fucking drive on. Driving like an ATV everywhere, a doing buggy. tricks and shit. Doing buggy. Or oh, yeah. Oh wait, I was talking about pure. Sorry, dirt. Dirt's like rally car shit. Dirt's fun. We gotta rent dirt. We gotta review dirt three. I Anyways. tried it at the UB Games once. It's pretty cool. Yeah. My mom tried it too. <laughs> how how much did she <laughs> fail at it? She couldn't really go anywhere. She, she should have just like rolled in neutral. <laughs> was it? What? Was it automatic? Yeah. She just didn't know how to go. Right trigger, isn't it? Yeah. Well, she didn't know that. <laughs> that's just like... That's one button. I know. For every game, the easiest game's to load. I know. Just shows how much my mom doesn't right know Right trigger's about gas. Left trigger's brake. Break. Steer with left Mahjong. stick. <laughs> hmm? Is she good at Mahjong? Yeah, very there you good. Go. <laughs> <laughs> I could beat her at for my life. I don't even know how to play that game. Watching my dad trying to play Portal is funny. The time my brother had to leave and I put my mom in to play his character in Halo. (laughs) That was a good time. Online, that was fun. That'd be fun. She spun around in circles and she spun around and shot. She hit some people, but they didn't die. It's just like Lars playing. Remember Lars playing Halo for the first time? He can, oh, his his yeah. reaction time was like four seconds too slow. Lars isn't the fastest, fastest oh, person. Oh, I'm getting world. shot! I'm dead. Oh, he's gonna shot from over there though. Oh. <laughs> anyway, his yeah. So playing fours. Um, I beat Trenched. Um, amazing game. Amazing XBLA game. Um, if you guys get it, um, please tell me because I want to play with more than just myself. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to stop playing with himself, people. So boring by myself. Give him someone to play with. Help him kick the habit. <laughs> I already hit max max level in like a week. <laughs> it's twelve hundred Microsoft points, so it's not too expensive. No. Fifteen bucks. No, it's actually quite affordable. Um, I liked it. A lot of people should get it. It's basically tower defense, but you're like a max. So you can put down turrets and upgrade them. You get. You can choose between machine guns, shotguns, sniper cannons, artillery cannons, grenade launchers, and broadcasters. You should know with all the rest of them are about broadcasters. It's pretty much just does constant damage if they're in close enough range. You don't really know what it... It just sends out like radio waves and disrupts their signal and fucking blows them up. It's cool. <laughs> well, it's uh, pretty much just a third person tower defense game. Yeah, pretty so. much. Just take a tower defense game off the internet, put a third person mech in place, and then you control the mech. And you get fucking sweet salutes. That's true. Like, you can get peace, fucking A-OK, um, flexing your muscles. Good to go. Patriotic. Fucking, I don't know what this is. Look at this. Peace. Um, Or is that the handy thing? That's the handy thing where it's like, just take jets across. I don't know. Yeah, it's just Maybe weird. it's just a limp wrist. I was like the one that just like, I think it was on the waves. Or just like, bye-bye. Anyways, yeah, definitely go get trenched or go even get the trial. There's a trial for it. Um, it's free. Um, let me know what you guys think in the comments below about trench. I played the 
trial for five minutes podcast. and then I bought it. Yeah, he, he, he didn't... <laughs> Actually, I don't even think I played... I shot, like, 13 bullets. It's like, okay, I'm buying it. If, if you love Max, definitely try out the trial. That's 13 bullets defense. with a machine yeah. gun. I won't... I don't like tower defense, so... <laughs> That's good. You're just not. gonna watch it on YouTube. Hey, you fucking nah, probably know the ending already, eh? Hey? No. What? One game that <laughs> Lama doesn't know the ending. And, and I beat it. I'm Max Devil. Um, you beat it before he watched it? I beat it. Oh my gosh. This is impossible. Just beat it. I have to find out what happens in Fear 3, too. <laughs> no! Okay! No! no! We're going to review Fear 3 sometime, okay? You can't just be watching it. Okay. Because we'll be playing it and you're We're like, gonna ah! We're going to wrap it night. <laughs> it's just like Dead Space 2. Oh, some scares going to happen. Oh, thanks, so. Yeah. Oh, I love this part. Oh, okay, thanks, so. We'll just duct tape them and throw them <laughs> in the corner. Nah, that didn't happen because you guys told me to shut up so I didn't say anything until you guys started, like, looking at me and waiting oh, yeah. for my reaction. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> that was fun. We know you know. And then when you guys really wanted me to know, I couldn't tell you because I skipped ahead in the video because I was getting bored. <laughs> 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 yeah, so I beat Trans. Definitely go pick it up. Um, other than that, I've only really been playing uh, Spider-Man and Shattered Dimensions. You play as Spider-Man, obviously Amazing Spider-Man, Ultimate Spider-Man, Spider-Man Noir, and Future Six Spider-Man, or Spider-Man 2099. Isn't there like a time crisis? What is, what's his name? The guy you got in the box. The warp? No, you had the bonus Negative card. suit? I think so. Yes. Negative zone? Negative zone suit. There we go. You know, you, you, I finally can just buy it. You just buy it? You can just buy it at the game, <coughs> but you have to do all 180 challenges. Fuck that. So, that's oh. a lot. Yeah, they're hard too. <laughs> Kill yeah. 1900 enemies in one shot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm close to finishing that game though. I'm um, thinking of like 3 or 14 things you have to beat. If you guys love Spider Man, go pick it up and keep that same humor. Um, a couple of downsides to the game, you get like locked in like. The pretty much like you get locked in room and you kill X number of bad guys that move forward sometimes. Kind of repetitive gameplay at certain points. But I do agree that like every Spider-Man you play as, so there's four different ones, they all have a different playing style. So it's not super boring because... Sorry? It, uh... It, uh... What you call it? Changes it up enough. So, yeah. Play Web of Shadows. Um, I told you I played it after Spider-Man Shadow Dimensions. And there's a new one coming out. Is there? Yeah. He's gonna watch it on YouTube. Yeah, he's gonna tell me all Probably. about it. <laughs> spoiler alert. When is it, when, it coming out? Like, I we don't should remember. change his name to Spoiler <laughs> King. <laughs> You're funny. I am. Yeah, you got to put up with lots of lots of arc light jokes. I like arc light jokes. They're so much fun. Or pun. Pun. Ah. Punerific. That was pun intentional. Pun you. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, that's pretty much all I've been playing. I'm going to punch you from this room. I'm going to kick you from this room. Okay. Just kidding, I won't The ban her. The reason I haven't played any games lately is because I'm in one of those moments where I've got a stack of games, like, that tall, and I don't know which one to play, so I just don't play any of them. Okay, what games do you have to choose from right now? Okay, Lost Planet, because I still haven't beat it, and I want to. Uh, I have Dark Messiah on Xbox, because it's got longer shit in it than the PC version. Um, what else do I have? I have Front Mission Evolved, Armored Core 4, uh, there's a lot of robot ones, Chrome Hounds, <laughs> there's Prey, there's, I'm playing Devil May Cry Why haven't you business. touched Prey yet? If anything out of that group, I, I played the demo, Prey. and the demo is like fucking 56 minutes long, that is a really random number, but it is like the whole first chapter. So? And it's so long! Then start playing Prey. But yeah. I played it, so I played so far into it. Then 56 minutes isn't that's so far, in it? Oh, maybe I'll just... Okay, that's like a quarter of the way through Homefront, but not through Prey. <laughs> Homefront was terrible. Yeah, <laughs> we tried to try like five times to get through Homefront. It's like a four-hour game. I call playing the helicopter mission. <laughs> I don't want to play anymore, I don't want to play anymore. <laughs> you're, right. play, you're playing it. That's a game I won't even look up spoilers for. <laughs> it's too bad for that yes. king to watch. You know it's bad. Well, we were, we were waiting for that so-called amazing moment in game storytelling history where the, like, right at the start where that kid's parents get shot. 
Spoiler. Spoiler. It's not a spoiler. They were announcing it. The they were announcing time. it the whole time. That was like the first thing they brought up about <laughs> it. Was like our kid's parents get shot in front of them. We're edgy. <laughs> Within the first minute. <laughs> and, they, uh, uh, and then I didn't even see it because I was looking out the other window of the bus. <laughs> yeah, you moron. <laughs> I saw it because I actually paid attention. I didn't. I was looking out the other window of the bus. It was, I don't know. The I first was looking for landmarks. Like, where's McDonald's? The end of the fucking, what was it? No, I was out. I like, energy drinks. There's lots of product placement like that. Yeah. yeah. There's terrible product placement. <laughs> so bad. I ever know. Oh, yeah, okay. So, um, don't play Armored Core 4 because you beat it already. I didn't beat it. Did you beat it already? I beat Armored beat Core 4 Answer. Oh. They're two very different games. Oh. It went, I don't know why I played Armored Core 4 Answer first. Is it supposed to come after Armored Core 4? Yes. Oh. But, and now I'm like in the more advanced game, so I'm like taking a step back a couple years. Yeah. And the environments look like shit. Yeah. And, like the buildings are freaking rectangles and that's it. Okay, so um, I recommend playing through... Prey. Prey. I'm down with that. And um... What is Prey. Okay, we're gonna give him two I'm gonna games. play through Prey, Prey twice. And Prey 2. Prey 2 is not out yet. And it will be, and it will you're be. fucked. <laughs> and then you're playing it. I you won't. are definitely playing it. Um, so yeah, go with Prey, and I'd say Armor Core 4. We'll go Final Fantasy. No. Fuck Final Fantasy no. right now. I have a shit ton of PS3 games to play too. Okay. Just play on Trader 2 again. I'm just going to stay up really late tonight and tomorrow night, so then my day's off. Oh. And I'll play video games. I'm beating Uncharted 2 on the weekend. Or do I want to play LOL? <laughs> LOL can suck your left nut. No, it play can't. Play through a game. It's in my computer, and I don't... Only play LOL when dancing is playing LOL, because then you can play it together. Or I can play with my brother. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Review that sentence. I can play with LOL with my brother. Yeah, right. Oh! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you can LOL with your brother. I can LOL with my brother. I would have a brother. Asshole. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Anyway, so this dancing is turn. I think I'm done. My. <laughs> Holy crap! Still? That was still that was yours. Yeah, yeah I'm still yeah, mine. <laughs> got to mine yet? Well, nobody loves you. I'm sorry. That was harsh. I'm sorry. I still love you. I can't <laughs> see you. You just play low with him. You just use him for low. That's all. <laughs> I, I, yeah. I use you for low. Just used. I didn't even give you referral points. <laughs> what? I didn't know I could, or how. <laughs> I thought you typed my name in the referral thing. I don't know. No, that was for the clam thingy. Oh. Whatever. Lit and piece of shit. I don't really care. Maybe you'll get an advancement and they'll put you to, like, private grade two. No. Oh, okay. That doesn't work that Continue way. with your games you played this week. I played League of Legends. <laughs> Is that well, it? Most, mostly. Uh, played a bit of Trench, too. I guess this isn't really last week. I mean, we yeah. played quite a few games. Over the um, past like months, not much on the indie market because that's pretty much what I look for. I said like three games this week. Right? I got played through them all. I've t seen them all. My goal. Like, oh. oh yeah, I've touched oh, them. That right. was a while ago. <laughs> you still talk about them. Yeah. It's always not like we've done a podcast before this. It's technically yeah. the first podcast. Oh, there's this one game that I found. It's uh, called Project Zomboid. It's like the zombie game. Um, I don't know how to really explain it. It's uh, it's classified as an isometric game, meaning I'm it's I'm like, lost. <laughs> well, you know how Sims looks like, you know, what, like, like the, the top camera angle. View? Yeah, like the angle is like angled. Yes. And it's like little squares. Yeah. Rather than like grid. Even, well, anyway, yeah, more like a grid. That's what it's like. A grid base shooter. And it's eight bit. Awesome. But like, does it have eight bit music? Um, <laughs> no, the soundtrack's pretty good though. But eight bit music is amazing. Yeah, I know. Batman. I like 8 bit. Or. But it's, uh. They have a demo out. It's just an alpha demo, so it's, like, not Is even, it on Steam? even close to finish. No, I have to go to their site. There's free games on Steam. Whatever now. happened to oh, Octodad? Oh. That game's hard. Octodad, it's hard to play. It ran out 8 frames a second on my computer. <laughs> it's pretty funny, though. <laughs> I gotta try this. It's physics based. Yeah, I know. I doubt your computer would have your laptop would handle it. It's a Toshiba. It can handle <laughs> anything you said. Apparently, it cannot handle sunlight because you do not want to take it outside. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking moron. It's black. 
What's that matter? So you're black racist. absorbs sun. Yeah? It's not gonna sit on fire. No, you're just because it's black, I don't want to be seen outside <laughs> with it, that's why. Wow. <laughs> racist. That was so bad. <laughs> you brought it up. No. I'm gonna get beaten up. Yeah, you will. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm gonna tell him where you live. <laughs> <laughs> no. I'm, okay, I'm gonna tell them where you work, so then they can just come to your work. Oh. I work at the Fudge Pack, King Factory. <laughs> So, so you're gay now? Yeah, I always was. But you have a girlfriend. So now we're being discriminatory against gays. <laughs> no, I'm nothing, I'm nothing against gay people. This is a terrible I podcast. I have absolutely nothing against gay people. In this podcast, we will have insulted every possible minority. No! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking gingers. <laughs> no, I'm, I, I'm okay with people if they want to wanna have a partner of the same sex. That's fine with me. There's nothing wrong with that. And now we're a social commentary podcast. Yeah. So let's, just, let's just talk about. No. So let's oh, talk about your feelings, like Jenna. This this yeah. Can I talk? Can we talk about your feelings? No. Can you bit? just shut up yes. and let him go no. through his thing? I sense <laughs> anger. <laughs> Anyways, Project Zomboy. You should go check out their site. You can probably just type it in Google, and find their site. Um, the gameplay is like really survival based. It's one of those games where you. You're like supposed to die, but there's just like so many different ways to die. Um, the demo is pretty cool. You start out with your, like it starts out with you and your wife. Your wife has like a really badly injured leg, oh, and she's laying game. in bed. You don't know what game we're talking about. I've heard about that. No, I've actually heard about that. That's actually. like 19 yeah. percent of zombie games right um, there. No, yeah. no, but and it's like based <laughs> or on zombie like, movies. It's based on your uh, your choices, right? Like you can, you can have you can like let her die off the start. And off well, yeah, you can turn. you can actually just take the pillow right. and muffle her. Yes, I was hearing about this game. I was supposed to. I was going to take a look look at it actually. You should can check you it out. Can you teabag her after that? No. Oh, damn it. Sorry. You would be a you. horrible husband. <laughs> no. I just. Smothered my wife. No, that's tea bagger when she's dead. <laughs> tea bag, tea bag, tea bag. Oh my god. There's yeah, quite a few bugs with it though, because it's like an alpha demo. Because it's like they weren't supposed to release it technically, but it just happened. Well, <laughs> on their main site. But it's just like Gears of War three as three was the yesterday. Oh yeah. It was. Yeah. But it, it wasn't a finished copy. What was it? I told you about this. Because people torrented it. Oh, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I torrented the first gears just to play through that one. Uh, okay, you're not supposed to admit to torrenting. Sorry. Whatever. Torrenting is bad. Pirating is bad. I deleted it in a day. Buy stuff off I. You were allowed to torrent if you get rid of it in 24 hours. You're, you're allowed to get Game Boy ROMs if you keep it. Uh, you're allowed to download a, a ROM if you own the real copy of the game. Yeah. Did you own the real PC version of Gears? No, but I only kept it for like 17 hours and then I deleted it. So that makes it perfectly legal then? No, it doesn't it's make just it just a rent with no money of all? Okay, and then, <laughs> anyways, we're gonna get the dancing finishes. Sorry, I'm, I'm sorry for interrupting you. It's okay. <laughs> would, would my laptop be able to run this game? Yeah, it's not like graphically intensive. It's gonna be a pretty nice looking game though. But there is a lot to do. And it's gonna be co-op, I believe, so... I'm definitely excited about that because I'm just two a people sucker to smother the wife. Two or yeah. five. <laughs> one to teabag, one to smother. What, I be the what, is, what is the wife? One is the guy. <laughs> Help me! Press X Y to pull off pillow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, I have a couple of videos on my channel. Well, there's one of a new game that I pu uh, put up. It's called Eye Fluid. <laughs> 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 it's, really, it's really called eye fluid. I know because I've seen it. Fluid. I haven't seen this video. When did you put this up? I put this up like a few days ago. <laughs> I I didn't pick it up on my. my I'll be book. honest. I've never watched a video of yours. <laughs> oh, the truth comes out. You're a dick. Are you kick him off the podcast? Yeah, you don't no. deserve to be on here, dude. When it's his turn, he talk less than when it's talked to through your turn. Oh. I know. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> I thought your thing might be the longest, too. And, and he was like, I, 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 I play low. Anyways. Oh, that's all I did. Okay, I'll stop. I'm going to just shut up now. I flew it as just like a platforming, I guess you could say platforming puzzle game. It's physics-based. And you, pay a, you play a water droplet, which I thought was sort of cool. Really? Yeah. That's cool. 
Get it. That's all you have to say, Luke. <laughs> yes, that is. <laughs> when you're not interrupting, that's all you have to say. Yeah. <laughs> I, I I played low this week. Yeah. Really? No, you didn't. <laughs> <laughs> I was just trolling Luke. That's what he said. That's what he said. I played low this week. Um, I also downloaded this game called Prown. It's like you spell noun, but you take out the N and put P-R. So it's Prown. So like you're prowning around. I don't know if it means anything, but it's a cool <laughs> cool little racing game. Uh, it's free, but it goes off donations. And if you donate, you get like the soundtrack, which is actually pretty decent. Even computer might not be able to run it very well. But <laughs> it's pretty cool. And you can it's donate anything. So like, donate a cent and you get the soundtrack pretty much. Five bucks. But you're like, your balls. <laughs> that, that didn't start off well. <laughs> your balls. Your balls. But no, like, I don't know. It's hard to explain without making it sound dirty. <laughs> Just, Just try. try. The balls. Just, Just try. It. I will show. Uh, the track is a long. <laughs> <laughs> it's a long, smooth shaft. <laughs> it is. It's a long, winding, like shaft. shaft. Oh, I know this game. Yeah. <laughs> And your balls, and your and your balls are around the shaft, <laughs> and, you're a sp- and they've got and, sperm and in the middle. There's obstacles in the way, so like, like eggs. I'm gonna use your arm. Okay, so here's the <laughs> here's the long <laughs> shaft. Here's the shaft. Is it gonna be and able to see this in the here, video? Bend it. Okay. When you reach the end, is white confetti. Let's say the shaft goes like this. And Will, you're gonna be the obstacle. Uh oh. So there's a there's a wall here. Are those so you can go obstacles? all the way. You can go all the way around the shaft <laughs> with your balls. But your balls race oh, along. Oh, your cords. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> your balls can, <laughs> can race along the shaft, and if you like, turn, you just go around it. So that's how you dodge obstacles: is you just turn and. It's really fast paced too. Does so. the game get just the camera shift also? Move yeah. all around the it's really colorful to too. Stuff. It's really nice looking. <laughs> I assume it causes colorful. epilepsy. No, it's not flat. It's like it's not flat. It's not like a. <laughs> no, no, it's, it's just like balls. And a shaft. There's no flashing. Balls in the shafts? Yeah. Balls going shaft. around shafts. Yeah. It's more of a two. That are colorful. <laughs> well, the obstacles are colorful. Oh. But, so like, your environment's colorful. So There's, like, a black, I mean, a white background. Okay. It's a really nice looking game. It's like, I don't know, I wouldn't call it cell shaded, but it's... More like dull shaded. <laughs> No, <laughs> not really. But yeah, that game's fun. So I downloaded that one. If Arc- I were you guys, Arc-like check joke. it out. Is it free? What's it's free. Like joke. Might have really? Class it's online or too. With the balls uh, in the they keep a, <laughs> You can play against computers, or you can have people playing on the same computer. So it's pretty nice. We'll you also play against like your somebody own on ghost. last and somebody yeah. on the arrow keys. We will. We will put the. Um, we will try to put the games that we played this week in the show notes. So if you guys miss the name of a game, I was too loud. Earthquake's being a little troll over there. I'm not being a troll. Okay, yeah, a little bit. Dude, we're all being trolls. It's okay. Except for Lama King. He just sits here and shuts up. Oh, I've watched that game before. Yeah. I've watched that game. I would have played Uncharted my whole life, but I've watched that game. <laughs> <laughs> but why are you playing Uncharted? You already saw it on YouTube. These is that good. Okay, valid. Nolan North. Should we play through yes. Uncharted 2, but not the first one? It wasn't there when I went, went to get my PS3. Oh, great. We were, we were there like last week. Why don't you pick it up? It's like ten bucks. Yeah. Also, Little Big Planet is nine dollars at Staples. He, awesome. You love yes. you've played Little Big Planet yes. this week. No, that was last week. Damn, you can still put it in the podcast. Nine dollars. Talk about that game. Little Big, it's not my typical game. It's just a kind of a kitty arcade game, but it's so fun that you're just jumping around just and you're just in, yeah, you're just enjoying yourself. It's going back to what games should be about just having fun and so you're just a little kid again and that's one of the reasons I like it it's just it's not serious or anything like everything else I'm not going around saving the galaxy like in Mass Effect I'm just jumping around goofing off technically you're saving little big planet no not from what I know so far (laughs) spoiler alert I'm just running around (laughs) (laughs) my character's just got this huge mustache I have bunny ears and I never really like unlockables, but un- unlockables in this game are just fun. These you're like told that you got a pirate shirt, and you're like awesome. And I'm like, I want an eye patch now. And so you're running around trying to find this stuff. 
My guy is a Mexican with a frying pan in his hand. That's what awesome. movie? Was that a movie or a game that the guy had the frying pan hey, did as his weapon? Okay, do you remember that? Frying pan? That's Tangled. Tangled? Yeah. Okay, no, yeah. Wait, what? Yeah, that's Wait, what it was. Oh, yeah. Yeah, well, yeah, he's got the frying pan. Tell me like hardcore video game people. Like, yeah, I was talking about an animated movie that was made for kids. Tangled. You said movies were loud? No, I'm just saying. At the end. No, oh, no, we don't bring up yeah. movies in here. This is our week. Just shouldn't really bring them up. Okay, maybe for referencing a movie when we're doing a review. It's okay. I just wanted to remember where the awesome frying pan is from. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Because I have no, it. I want to watch Tangled again, even though I'm trying to be a macho hardcore viewer. I've movie. never Tangled seen Tangled. Tangled. Movie, though. Anime. Yeah, so? What about it? Just watch more. <laughs> I'm, I'm stuck in this one anime. I just don't have time to watch it anymore. Anyways. I got Chrome Shell the Regios. That's what I've played. Dancing, did you ever finish? I can't remember. <laughs> what? Did we cut him off again? <laughs> you cut me off. Oh, okay. What is this we? It's always you. <laughs> well, I went on it's about a big planet. Yeah, that's the guy that told you, because I, I know you love that game, so I wanted you to talk about it. That was fun. His his review of it, like, him talking about actually made me want to get a Which PS3 game? for that game. Little Big Planet. It would be even more fun well, with fine friends. Game, I mean, I got it for free. That's what made me happy. His PSN network went down. Oh yeah, that's one of the games. And I didn't pick. really, I didn't really play my it's PlayStation come, that whole back couple in months. In, in Japan this week for the first time. Really? Yeah, I just yeah. came back <laughs> <out of laughs> in Japan. It's like the people who actually buy it. Ah! <laughs> like, yeah. oh. Little Big Planet would definitely be a game that would be even funner with friends. It is like, retarded to be fun with. I just, I've only had one controller for like a year. I've had the stupid. I game. only ever get one controller because I never really have anyone at my house playing games. Yeah, because never invite us over. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Asshole. I want to see this grassless lawn. <laughs> what? <laughs> the assless yeah. lawn? That sounds terrible. <laughs> so you you down for what you played this week? Yeah, that's pretty much all I, all I Is played. Is there any Shadow games you want to like, just hey, what? Like, play just for fun, like Team Fortress or anything? Oh yeah, I played a lot of Team Fortress too. And yeah. it's free right now, so if you have a computer that can run it, go get it. Because <laughs> you can't run it. Yeah, I don't think so. I can try. I know so. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to download, I'm gonna download WoW. Why? My my, tw- my level twenty trial. I'll punch you. I will. Why? What's the You're gonna no. get hooked on it. I know you will. No, I won't. Those no. are not my kind of Byron games. Byron wouldn't get hooked on it. <laughs> we already used all our names. It's, yeah, it's fine. Except right. his. No one knows his name. Well, okay, just because <laughs> just because you use both so names. Generic. I'm Michael. This is Byron. That's Will. And. This fucker is Luke. Okay, <laughs> this is gonna go very well if you do like the audio thing on iTunes, cause like, this is me, if you cannot see me. Anyways, this video is gonna be on one of our YouTube channels. Um, we could just keep doing video videos. iTunes is over like Go for yeah. Zoom. <laughs> I have a Zoom. Represent. I'm like the one in four people who actually bought one. Get the hell oh, out right? of here. Zoom. What's a Zoom? It is a <laughs> rip off iPod. It's, oh, Microsoft. it's the Microsoft iPod. I got it because I can plug it into my Xbox. That's the only reason. You can plug I, it in an iPod and have it. Yeah. Well, I couldn't at the more time, on. and it was okay. I think it was more expensive, but no. it was red. Zooms are about the same price as an iPod. And they don't. Make they were more at the time. <laughs> 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 Moron. <laughs> it had more memory than the iPods did that I could find. Yeah. They how also much, much failed. The only, the only iPods I could find at the time were forty gigs, and mine's an eighty. Well, there's 8 gigs. There's 160 gigs going now. Yeah, but that's out now, not like four well, years ago. That was ago actually that was actually a few years ago. <coughs> but I couldn't find one at the time. Okay, that's fair. And the only I- the iPod I bought off the website was broken. It was dead in box, so I just sent it right back. Yeah, you gave money back. Yeah, I did. Get a and Zoom then for I bought it? a Zoom. <laughs> 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 Apple let me down. Zoom let you down. Okay. No, Apple let Where me. Where is the Zoom marketplace? On my computer. Is there even, is it still open? Yes, just not in Canada, I don't think. <laughs> and where do yes. you live? In Canada. Fucking <laughs> <Durr. laughs> Okay. Whoa, I think that's like Lots 40 weekly. minutes. <laughs> Anyways. Next topic. Uh, okay, are we done with what we played this week? No one has anything else to add? <coughs> I have to get back into playing The Witcher 2. You do. You have not finished that game. Okay. I've. I'm not even done the first act. Fuck. I'm at the like midway boss, and I'm just kind of pissed off with the game. I'm taking a break. I hate the people who are going. Dragon Age Two sucks. The Witcher Two's awesome. They both have their flaws. 
but the problem is everyone's giving The Witcher 2 a free pass when its flaws are probably way worse than The Witcher's. Whoever thought that every time you save in The Witcher 2 that it would be, give you a separate file was a friggin' idiot. Because if you're even trying to find an old file to go back on, you now have an entire list of about a thousand different files to go look through and you ha can have fun trying to figure out which save you wanted. Can you it's name a, No, name you, can't, you can't name them. It, <coughs> name, it names them after the quest that you are currently or uh, you just finished. I usually do that anyways in games, though. I save as many as I can. Yeah, but it's, a con it's just a constant stream. I like the compact mine. Yeah, so I actually know what's yeah. happening, and because you might want to go back a couple hours, good luck going through the entire list of Doesn't everything. Doesn't it have, like, game time? It has a small game time, but it's just a stupid system when every other give game... give you choice. <laughs> That's yeah. what I like. And the other main problem is it has the most horrible tutorial. And people keep on saying, well, you just read the manual in the game, but... For the past at least three years, we've been saying you should never have to read the instruction manual. So you shouldn't have to read the instruction manual in the actual game to understand the play. When you have a quick five-second um, tutorial on the screen saying, you are in stealth mode, that's not helpful if what you really need to know is, as long as you don't have a weapon in your hand, you are in stealth mode. Especially when you're coming from a background of growing up watching people who are older than you play the Thief games where your primary weapon was the blackjack, mm -hmm. and the only weapon you have currently in these stealth missions is the blackjack, that suddenly you can't be in stealth with this weapon, and they never explain it, and that is incredibly frustrating, because it, they don't even explain it in the actual tutorial when you look in the stuff. To find out why I wasn't in stealth mode, I had to actually go on a forum, which they were then explaining yeah, if you have a weapon out, you are no longer in stealth. That's pretty cool. And when you're supposed to be a friggin' witcher, a monster slayer, <laughs> you would think you could carry around a small stick and still be stealthy. Yeah. That's I'm so true. bad at this guy, but if I hold the stick... Random note, thank you for clearing up what a witcher was, I didn't know. <laughs> <laughs> what did you think it was? I don't know, I thought it was like... Something to do with a witch? A man yeah, witch! Was, well, technically it's got to do with a witch, because if he's a monster killer, is a witch a monster? He's, he's no, it's just. It's fucking like a Devil May, May Cry guy. Don't the Witcher is only an English translation, in wherever I forget the year of country that it comes from. It he's actually called the Hexer. Is it? No, isn't it German? No, it's not Germany. Isn't it? Norway. It's, it's Austria. Or <laughs> I forgot. Norwegia. I no, forgot. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. So that was a fail by Arclight. <laughs> this week Ar this week this week spells Arclight Norwegia. I <laughs> love the we <laughs> There are probably multiple fails all all by Arclight. Yeah, they usually are. We need a blooper reel of me. No, because this is actually still in the podcast. <laughs> The so Arclight blooper power hour. We're just gonna have an <laughs> annotations going with all your fails. <laughs> It's, it's gonna be too long of a list. <laughs> All the fail like characters. Fifteen, just dude. Arc Arc gets failed number one thousand three hundred sixty-four. It's like a little what, counter in the bottom is just steadily going up. <laughs> what, what, what episode are we on? Um, fifteen. <laughs> dude, oh, he already broke six. <laughs> <laughs> what the? Fuck? <laughs> yeah. Is it? Right? Yeah. So yeah. I'm ooh, yet you guys the make me play the games all the time. <laughs> what? Yep, every, anytime we do like a we well, do like says, gameplay footage, I play. It, it, <laughs> Everyone else falls asleep except me. <laughs> hey! I'm I, sitting in the chair and you guys are all sleeping behind me. Trend. I'm sorry that I've, I've over 24 hours this week already. <laughs> I saw enough of the me game too. <laughs> that I knew what was. I knew if I was going to say it was a good game or not. I actually stayed up the entire time watching Luke play. On that note, let's get to that game. Yeah. Um. Okay, that game, we've. Going to review this week, our second segment is Shadows of the Damned. <laughs> Anyone know who who's it by? Uh, Suda fifty one. Pseudo Pseudo fifty one. Pseudo fifty one. We're gonna be Studio called 51. noobs now. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Suda. It's Suda. It's over there, and I can't see uh, it. The same producers that same. They did no more heroes. They did no more heroes and Killer Seven. 
I've never played Killer 7. I never played Killer 7. It's supposed to be a trippy game. It's, it's supposed to be fucked. good, though. It's fucked. You play as like seven different assassins, I think it is. They all have different traits. Now. Uh, Back to Shadows uh, of the Damned. It's, it's for the GameCube. Back to Cube. Shadows of the Damned. No, I'm gonna I tell them now it's for the GameCube, so we'll uh, pick it up. Oh, sometime. wait, no, I've heard of that one. Okay, yeah. Okay, um, good. Yeah. Good so, um, are you playing? Do you want to talk yes. about Shadows of the Damned? Well, since I played it, I guess I should say. I should. <laughs> so, I really like the music. I thought that was a strong okay, point. Okay, uh, um, can, can we go back and like, can yes. you explain, like, what Shadows of the Damned is, and then we'll talk about like, what we thought of it. Would you say it's action horror? I don't know if it's I should throw horror. that horror in there. It's There's like zombies and shit, it's, or demons. It's kind of a horror. It's, it's, it's got the vibe. It's like a on, trippy horror. It's on the vein of it's Resident not like, Evil. It's yeah. like Resident Evil 4 well, and 5. Okay, it's not like scary horror, it's like trippy horror. It's... It's yeah, more it's disturbing. Like, it's like you're in hell like kind a, of deal. Like a messed up horror. Yeah, yeah it's, it's disturbing. It's disturbing says horror, you're in because hell. like... It's not scary, but it just you and there know. is so much innuendo, and I love it. Sexual yeah. innuendo. That's all this game <laughs> like, is. Penetration. Like, boner. Like your guy. My boner. god, his name Boner. I like, love it. The <laughs> boss takes a piss to bring the darkness into the world. <laughs> when you go in the darkness, your your buddy gets all flaccid. <laughs> your your Johnson gets flaccid, but when you're out of the darkness, your Johnson's straight and pointy. It's erect. It is erect and on fire. And to clarify, Johnson is a demon. your fellow demon companion who is a, a skull, skull head. and he's he also fighting. all your weapons. Yeah, that he you can, and he's he your motorcycle. Transform. He is also yeah. your motorcycle. He can, he can transform into uh, yeah your guns. Uh, the pistol's called the boner. There's um, the... I can't remember it? any of them. So there's, one of them's called the there's skull the fucker. Teether. The, the skull, teeth, the teether. Skull. The teeth. The teeth is the machine really gun. There's really only the assault rifle? Whatever. Whatever. There's yeah. a machine yeah. and assault rifle. And then there's skull the Skullfucker's a shotgun, skull, I think. Skullfucker? It was the Skull oh. Cushioner. Cushioner? Yeah. Cushioner? Oh, Skullfucker's, I think, the achievement that you get for using it. Yeah. yeah. And then there was that achievement that was supposedly really goddamn yeah, hard, yeah, but yeah. I killed it on my third uh, the, enemy. The puppeteer, it's, uh... Yeah. Shoot a guy in the knee, and as he's falling, yeah, shoot him as, in the face. As yeah, as they like, shoot off his limb, he falls, and if you shoot off his face before he hits the ground, you get a, a pretty hefty achievement. I mean. 30, 30 gamer points? 30 gamer points. I got for that? That was pretty good. <laughs> what was that? The third guy I yeah, killed. Yeah, that was pretty much the third guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thing with like Resident Evil, like normally when you're aiming, you can't really walk around. But in this game, you can. But it's just really hard to aim. Aim when you move around. But it's got like the same kind of view of Resident Evil yeah. Five. But the controls are so much clunkier. Yeah, yeah it looks like really clunky. Like it's I had, I had aiming speed cranked, and I was still like. Yeah, it looked like it was <laughs> slow. I do like how you like. It That's, makes it more well, of a tactical. It did come in. It did really come like. in handy when I could hit like A and A, and it would spin me around. Yeah. yeah. Because it would be way too damn slow it to spin around. Like when you press A, it spins 180 degrees. Which well, they had good. that. They had yeah. that in Resident Evil. But they yeah. had like everything mapped to the A button that they could. So it was like, hold left and A to dodge left. But then, yeah. I would like turn around and then I would dodge left. But yeah. that would put me on the right of where I was before, and then my mind was just destroyed. It's just like Portal! <laughs> Not as my destroying as Portal. <laughs> or Prey. Prey just... Play Prey! Prey makes you want to play at some point. Prey, Prey! Prey, Prey! Prey, Prey! Play? Prey, Prey. Play. I should make my mommy play Prey. <laughs> I think she would die. She gets motion Let's go sick. back time with oh, Shadows of the Oh, she wouldn't be able to play that. Okay, Shadows uh, of the Damned. Yep. Um, yeah. Well, you're Mexican. You're... you're yeah. What's, what's Garcia... You're, you're Spanish. Garcia hot, Hotspur. Hotspur is the main character. Garcia they, they, fucking Hotspur. Why do I get the feeling there's innuendo in that name that I'm just not getting? Garcia motherfucking Hotspur. No, it's fucking. Just fucking Hotspur. No, 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 he's motherfucking. No, it's fucking. He died with a purple jacket. That's what his tombstone is. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was a joking tombstone, but that, he's still his fucking. purple Which jacket. Which he grabs in the walk that purple jacket. He grabs it in the yeah. open sequence, and then when he goes into hell, suddenly he's wearing it, even though yeah. he jumped in the portal without it on. Yeah. He jumped in the blue portal. Oh, so pretty much, orange you want you to tell them why you're in hell? You're looking for your girlfriend. You're looking for your blonde girlfriend. Paula. With the weird past. With the telephone. <laughs> oh, yeah. There Which might be spoil doesn't... spoilers in this review, just yeah, a heads up. Yeah, because we just, like, talk about everything in the game. I don't know if that's really spoilers, though. I'm just saying. I, just I really you... think it's yeah. going to be spoilers because there's no point in talking about it unless it's going to be important. It's kind of a, what you're going to use your time discussing. So I think it's going to have some relevance later on. 
Yeah, that's true. It must, yeah. And I did like how after the boss battles you get like the little backstory on them. Yeah. Yeah. Which like, was really neat. With the uh, with uh, George. George was funny. George or Yog. Or he called him Jorge at one point, I think. Yeah, he was just because he's Mexican. The boss <laughs> of the end of Act Two was George, right? Yes, but there were um, two versions of George. You fell asleep through both of them. <laughs> no, I, I watched the second one. Did you? Like the one where he's like riding a horse. Yeah, but yeah, you missed you the f- second part of that battle. Where he takes the piss and everything. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay, I only missed that part. Well, no, I saw him eat the horse, and then I saw him grow, and then I fell yeah. back asleep. Yeah. Okay, no, he ate the horse's heart, and then he Yeah, he and then he grew, and then no, he ate the did. horse. Yeah, and, and then, then he took a piss. <laughs> well, and then he pissed out darkness. That's why I said spoiler alert. I'm sorry, guys. But this is bad. They also I mean, it's not like a major story point or anything. It's just like a boss battle. Yeah. They also play it out like a movie. <laughs> It's and he no. was insatiable, and he delved into Mary's beaver. <laughs> yeah, that was George. He apparently never was full. <laughs> the best thing ever. Um, like, like the title screen, like where you like save it seemed like a Quentin Tarantino movie, kind of where like yeah. Shadows of the Damned came in. It just seemed like it had that kind of feel to it, and like as you're like choosing your save game file or whatever, he's riding a motorcycle through like an open road. So he's riding his Johnson. <laughs> yeah. Through an open road, and he's. he's so much innuendo. When you're opening doors, you're just thrusting while holding your Johnson. Yeah, yeah he's like. <laughs> and the and same with lighting the. Fireworks. fireworks. The you fireworks. Stick, you stick your Johnson in the hole and. Sh- <laughs> push it back and forth, yeah. and the fireworks explode into the I sky. I still like when, like, right at the start, he's like, there will be much penetration. No, you lack penetration. Yeah, you lack, oh, you lack, lack penetration. penetration. You lack penetration. You need more thrust. And <laughs> it's like, oh my and god. And then you eat the demon, the main demon who's taking your girlfriend, Flemeth, who then tells you that he's Fleming. <laughs> Fleming. <laughs> Flemeth is from Dragon Age. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and that's a woman. If it was shape a woman shape raping there. a woman. Shape you are such there. a horn dog, well, <laughs> female on female. Like, you're a girlfriend and dancing girlfriend. Every time they're together, you guys should have a lesbian. That's right? a poop grab. It's <laughs> reciprocated later. We don't need to tell the people the podcast. <laughs> I was just saying you're a friend <laughs> for that. Back to shadows. Can yeah, back to shadows. Yeah, but now we can put lesbians in the tag. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. We can. It's I talked about it for about ten yeah. seconds. That is the requirement. So now we're moving on. Yeah, we are not. We're not a horn dog. Just okay. Like, let's talk about the movie. Hey, I can see that <laughs> music. It's oddly placed, but it is good music. Yeah, it's, it's oddly. It has the same music producer as in Silent Hill 2. And you'll, if you've played Silent Hill, you'll notice. Yeah. Fuck is it similar? What? Is it really oh, it's so yeah. similar? Yeah, like, like, you know the, the like, chime you get after like opening a door and shit? Sort of. It's the exact same chime as in Silent Hill 2, pretty much. That's cool. That's cool. Oh. It's fine, don't worry about it. Mm, okay, it might be me. No. Nobody <laughs> wants me. Oh yeah. uh, nobody loves you. Uh can't ever know more about it. Um it's just just the pockets doesn't I mean text it doesn't really matter. Um <laughs> anyway, so yeah. Um I should you get final thoughts about the thing or do you wanna oh, anything else you want to talk about? The game mechanics actually look really good even if the controls, controls are clunky but it is so it does have a lot of interesting ways, and it was constantly adding new elements in. I hate yeah. the baby doors. Why? Because they're creepy? Why, 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 why the hell do I have to open a demon with a strawberry? Yeah, or a brain, a or an eye. Yeah, there's like, the, there's like a gate with like a little baby head, and you have to give it something for it to open up the door, and it's like... Or you're shooting goat heads. Then. Yeah. To, the goat heads weird me out. To kill the darkness, you have to like shoot a ghost head, and the darkness... Does damage to you. It's kind of. It slowly does damage to you, and the way to you heal while in darkness is collecting human hearts, which are scattered on the ground. Nice. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It likes to do a lot of weird. You stuff. never noticed that? Were you sleeping through the whole time I was in the darkness? No, I just never saw you collect hearts in the dark. Oh. Okay. It's constantly throwing new things at you. It's but um, yeah, like when he's telling me how to do something, and I already figure out how to do it before he tells me how to do it. Yeah. The dialogue changes. Yeah. It's yeah. Just, it's just pretty it's, cool. It's and then dynamic. like normally he'd be like. Use the right bumper to light attack them and get it off. But instead of that, I did it before he told me that. So he's like, oh, how'd you know how to do that? Yeah. Yeah, that's And cool. I really do like um, Johnson's voice actor. Yeah. yeah he suits, it, suits yeah, yeah. it very it's well. It's sort of the same, like, same, in the same sense as Portal 2. It's Wheatley. Wheatley yeah. It's using 
a British comedic British ish. I don't know if he's British or not. He had a British accent. Is it British? A bit, he's yeah. British or he's pretending to be British. Or he's okay. But he's more interesting than Garcia, I find. Garcia yeah. is generic. He's Mexican though. That's like a first. Yeah, it is actually the first time a Mexican. Is he actually Mexican or is he just supposed to be oddly I, Spanish? I don't his know. Name, first name is Garcia. He might be his. Well, he, <laughs> yeah, might, he might be <laughs> Spanish and not. He need. He's got I, a retarded amount of tattoos. Yeah. Which yeah. kind of creeped me out. The weird thing though is they go through so much detail showing in the opening thing and now you have constantly have his jacket on the entire time. So I'm, I'm it's kind of wasted. I'm assuming there's like a final thing where often is. His like tattoos, tattoos are going like, to be like the... Do they come out and like form creatures <coughs> that he has to kill? It's like all of his sins in this thing. If that happens, I'm turning the game off. <laughs> Why? Why would you turn the game off? Because if his tattoos come alive, I'm turning the game off. Why? Because they're Who's tattoos serious? and they shouldn't come alive. No, that's not going to happen, even though this game is weird at points. But definitely what I found was interesting is they're constantly changing what you have to do. You'll have to go into the darkness so you can shoot something so you can get out of the darkness. And so they're constantly throwing new things at you, so you have to change what you're doing and change your strategy. <laughs> the demon pubes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> if you shoot like a hole in the wall out in the darkness, remove the demon, demon pubes, pubes from the game. Which are connected to the core with like an umbilical cord. And yeah. Or they're bringing demons who are bringing the darkness back if you don't yeah. shoot them away from the light. <laughs> Do they even attack you? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, well, no, before, I don't think so. <laughs> before they were being behind you and they were just walking towards the light, so you were able to shoot them all you wanted. They never attacked you. Their main purpose was just to get the light, so they completely ignored you as you were blowing them with smithereens. With my shoddy. <laughs> shoddy I shoddy. still don't get that, because like, after the second boss, or was that the third boss? I don't know. I don't know if you count the guy with the spinning hand as a boss. No, that was like a mini boss. That was a mini Let's say the second big boss. I got the shotgun, but I already had the shotgun. Yeah. Was that just because I was on Lemon Hunter? I have no idea. Yeah, you were on the pussy one, maybe? Well, it was Lemon Hunter. He was on the easiest no, 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 difficulty. Because, uh, yeah, we just, we, we just did it for a view. I've seen it on normal, and you have the shotgun as well. We have the green. Oh, okay. That's style gun. Is it just maybe an upgrade, then? Maybe. But it's, Must still be. it's still called the Skull Cushioner, isn't it? Yeah, we can still be an upgrade for it, though. Maybe. I don't know. Final. I don't know. Are we doing a score system? Let's do a unique score system. Like Pi. Out of four, how many thumbs up? Eight. Huh? I'm confused. I don't know. There's four of us, and most are out of five. So let's do it out of no, four. No, I don't want to do it out of four. Four is a pretty not? bad number. Let's do it out of eight. How about sixteen? How about thirty-two? <laughs> thirty-two. Let's just do thumbs up or something. Yeah. Uh, do I just yeah. two thumbs down? Okay. You gotta two say thumbs up. Two thumbs up? Max, two thumbs up. I'm gonna go Max? one and a half. I'm gonna go one and three quarters. God damn you. <laughs> um, one and five eighths? No, one and a half. Let's go one and a half. You're even. Yeah. You fell asleep through the whole thing, so you just didn't I'm gonna go it. with one thumbs up because, like, I like the game. It was fun, but it's not worth the six six sixty dollars when it came out. Agreed. Uh, if it like, dropped to like thirty, I would buy it. If it was thirty, yeah, I'd buy it. It seems like it's really short. Like how many hours did we play? I uh, not even two, and I was already on the third act. Yeah, and there's only five acts in the game. You were on easy. Though. But then it, yes, but still, I was on easy, but it was like just still like, strolling through very fast. I was it's like for quick. an easy game, I was strolling through very quickly. Normally, on an easy game where I'm rushing through like that, I yeah. will die because I'm rushing. Yeah, you, I don't think you died once. Oh, but... You were finding secrets and everything. I was finding a lot of secrets. Yeah, so... Like, I had, like, three saved-up strawberries that yeah, I had used. Yeah, like, it seemed like the game's really short. There's no, like, multiplayer uh, or One other thing I disliked was even though my health was full, it would still let me drink my health potions. Yeah, that's and it would, a bad they idea. they would just waste. Because I would keep accidentally hitting left bumper for some reason because I wanted to run. And if for some, left Isn't that how you run reach? in Dead Space? Yeah. Uh, you no. left... Bumper? Left bumper. Yeah, it is. Yeah, because I just kept pushing that to run because yeah. you have to hold the right trigger to run, which really pisses me off. You could probably switch that, though. Yeah, but half the time I'd press the right trigger to run and it would still just jog normally. Yeah. And I'd have to you push it down really, really, really hard. I'd like smash it. it down and push forward really I hard. I did notice that they were constantly giving you health 
though. Yes, they there always was constantly, there was a lot of help. There's a ridiculous amount this is, when you think of the type probably, of game it's, it's kind of trying to be. Probably because you're not easy though. Yeah, that's true. Honestly, and then it would so. give me a ton of ammo, which I would never use. That definitely well, because you're getting a ridiculous easy. amount of health without even blowing up a lot of crates and stuff. Yeah. You walk by a ton of stuff that you could have checked to see. One thing I will also note is that your melee attack is shit. Terrible. You'll do one hit, and then you can do it again, and you'll completely miss. You can only do it every second attack, essentially. Because they're being knocked back, or you'll even still hit hit them within the animation, but it does nothing. And it's incredibly weak. You will, you're yeah, unlikely it's, to kill anyone. It gets rid of the darkness off them. Is the melee thing more to get it's things more, away from it's you? It's more it's to get the darkness back. off them. And it knocks him back like yeah, a foot. I think, I think it just knocks back and stuns him so you can actually pull out, pull out your gun if you get too close. I think that's all it's used for. It's not meant to kill. Yeah. That's what it seems like. If it's meant to kill, they failed epically at it. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> I don't know. It's CDF 51 or whatever, man. It's, he, he makes fucked up games. <laughs> yeah, they've been constantly be doing these immature jokes, which... A lot of them are actually kind of funny in their own way, but then they also do some really awful <laughs> jokes. The joke about the <laughs> highway to hell on the internet was really awful. I don't remember that. Oh joke. yeah, he goes according to the internet. Oh yeah, and stuff. And that was just screen. yeah, that was just terrible. You guys all laughed at that. I did laugh at because it. it was I awful. enjoyed it. Yeah, it's like one of those bad jokes you laugh at just because it's bad. It's better than your jokes. I find that offensive. Trolled. <laughs> um, that's that's a troll fist pump. Uh, fist pump. I'm gonna give Shadows of the Damned one and half. Why? Why are you taking the half off? Or oh, okay, what were, What did you like for it? What did you not like for it? Just quick. Well, it, for one, it's actually a pretty nice looking game. Is, I like yeah, the art style it of it. It is very nice. Um, and I'm not one to really care about how long a game is, as long as it's, it's like sort of like a really, really good ride. Um, that's sort of why I like the... Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> that's why I sort of like the Call of Duty campaigns, is because they're really like fast-paced and they're really fun, but they're not sure, They're not very long. Are, I you, thought I was you, the only one who liked Call of Duty campaigns. Do, do you guys really. want to talk about the Black Ops campaign? No. How you didn't rest at all? It was just pretty... Action, action, action. Hi. Hi. How's it going, Mom? <laughs> You're on the podcast. Do you want to say anything? Probably won't She's yeah. just nodding her head. <laughs> mm hmm. Simba's in here, my dog. <laughs> Bye, Simba. <laughs> See ya, Simba. Leave my room, please. Oh, you can come. <laughs> Just leave the door open. It's okay. He'll leave. Okay. Anyways, you can get back to your. What the? What the? F what the f <laughs> Hold on. Okay, can I go back? Anyways. <laughs> We can cut that out, right? Awkward transition. Awkward transition. Okay, man. Um, <laughs> what was I talking about? <laughs> the nipple grab train? That always came out my nose. <laughs> that would hurt. Monster up the nose. I had orange juice. That burns like shit. Man, we didn't talk about what we're drinking today. I thought we were going to insert that. No. <laughs> Refreshing. Nah. Had you won me the monster hat? <laughs> I tried! Yeah, but you fail at the call. Right. <laughs> okay, go back to here. <laughs> I'm thinking of what I was thinking. Um, you're talking about that you don't care much about the. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm done with, I'm done I'm with that. A, a, a he doesn't care um, about the length. I like, I like the ride. <laughs> <laughs> That's what she said. Uh, I, like the, uh, I like the comedic elements. Uh, really good script, I found. I mean, Garcia got a bit annoying, but... Okay, he got really annoying. <laughs> <laughs> his, his dick jokes kind of get old, actually. Yeah. yeah. He also has things. the most messed up love story. He's essentially kidnapped this girl. Yeah. <laughs> and yeah. she doesn't talk to him until she gets a random phone call, which has not been explained yet. <laughs> and also, it 
the gameplay reminds me of Resident Evil 5 and 4, which are like two of my favorite games. And so. 3. And 3. And 2. And, two. and 1. Yeah, but those are a bit different. I haven't, Tiny bit different. I haven't played any of them. Well, the first ones are like I've seen a those totally two. like lot different in how you play and stuff like that. But yeah, what I don't like about it, um, I don't know, it just doesn't seem like a game that keep my attention it's enough just, enough for a full blown like sixty seventy dollar price tag. Just because is it sixty? Yeah, it's sixty. Oh, okay. Bucks. It's just because the jokes get old. Yeah. I mean, well, like, and it's just I don't know. Well, that's the problem with paying for the name. It's because yeah. like, it is a good publisher name. I just we just none of us can remember what it's called. Pseudo fifty one. I think it's pseudo fifty one. Somebody check, check it. I feel like an idiot right now. We're gonna be called noobs. <laughs> I don't care. It's EA. It's EA and Grasshopper Manufacture. We're idiots. Oh, there is nothing there yeah, that's yes. a pseudo. Look at the top. No, Look at that, the top. That's where Look the guys the come from. Look at the back. Pseudo51 is one of the guys. Look up. Look up. Just give me it here. Gimmer. It's because Suda they talent. 51. Suda. Suda 51. Well, I was one vowel off. Pseudo? Pseudopod? Yeah, but it's a nightmare yeah. team. Like, that's yeah. the name of the team. We're fucking idiots. Shinji Mikami and we Akira really double Yamaoka. double check these before we... No, it's eh, okay. That's all Last, good. Last people must have been video game podcasts. Not really. 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 Not how many I'm, thumbs? I'm going. So one. Draw. Yeah. So so you're just going plan. I'm going meh. It looks like as. Really His verdict is he's gonna watch it on YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got me. You got me. <laughs> Continue. Uh, it looks like it has really good game mechanics. I mostly focus on story, so I might actually watch it just to see what's going on. Or Wikipedia. Yeah. Jump. Well, more to see what's. Maybe they'll make a novelization. <laughs> <laughs> It ha Johnson is a good character, <laughs> but Garcia is annoying, and there's a few other elements that are kind of iffy. They they built up in the first scene, Fleming, quite a bit, and we've gone through the first act and the second, and act. second act, and he's not reappeared despite the fact that he's we've seen his hands. That it's the more the presence. We've that, seen his hands. It's more the presence of him talking trash no, to you like you he did saw in the him first the scene. In the third act. Did we? For like. A second. He was mm. with uh, Paula. Oh yeah. yeah, that's right. But in the very beginning, he's trash talking you, and that's something that should have kept on going through the game. This guy is just trash talking you as he makes innuendo about being with your girlfriend that he's captured, and now he's totally non-existent, and it looks like very likely you're not gonna see him until the very end of the game again. So it's a missed opportunity when you start actually having a villain. And now he's completely gone for the stupid random bosses you have that he sends out. Yeah, like during the boss fights, you just have him in the back and be like, oh, you faggot! Faggot! Just chirping, you know? No, you just faggot, but, you know. Well, you know, like that stuff. If he's like, like really, really clever innuendo during the boss fights. You have a penis. <laughs> the shaft jokes? You are stroking the shaft. Not enough penetration. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You need penetration. I'm sorry. <laughs> Get the joke right. <laughs> it's not a joke, it's on your window. It's still a funny joke. Okay. Lou. Yes. Ar Arclight. Whatever. What about your We've broken this barrier. <laughs> My Dick, thumbs? Dick munchers. Thumbs. I you know what thumbs are? Yeah, I know How many the, thumbs? I have two thumbs. I'm so you're giving it two thumbs? No, I'm not going to give it two thumbs. And how many thumbs are you giving it? I'm going to give it one and... A half. One and a half. One and a half. One and a half. We're only going to do on the half thing. Like How come? Like one and three one and a half. I agree. Johnson is an interesting character. I want to shoot Garcia in the face. Good, good I Johnson. think Johnson needs his own spin-off game. <laughs> that would make me happy. Like an just, arcade game. He just like walls down with a gun and then switches into like a shotgun and a torch. That wouldn't be too bad. It was like a side-scroller. <laughs> it's a platformer game. Just oh, God. Now yeah. I can see it on the move. <laughs> oh, <Yeah>. shit. <laughs> I'll play with my Johnson. It would be fun for me. I would, I would, because if it had the same writing, just no Garcia, because I hate his guts. 
It's gonna be the same writer because Garcia decided it. Well, like the same writing for Johnson. Granted, he couldn't make. Like, if they switched the roles and made Johnson the main character somehow. Or, or Paula has. Paula has her Johnson. <laughs> that would be a sex game. Yeah. I don't want that. But Sexual spin off. Yeah. Are you okay? And she's generic character, too. <laughs> Grand Theft Auto Hot Coffee, anyone? <laughs> I don't no. Think. It's a. It's a oh. mod where they have. We'll explain this off camera just because it's <laughs> really long. Well, okay. no, we're, we're in like an hour and 11 minutes. No. So? How do you see that? It says one hour and 11 minutes. It's 111 and then like, yeah. 40 seconds. Make a wish. <laughs> We're gonna cut up the beginning because we feel like five minutes to begin the podcast. That's pretty fun. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Anyways, so yeah. Final thoughts. One and a half. Good music. Some good characters. Why? Oh, yeah, type of music. Yeah. Agreed with I'm Fleming. Probably. Fleming. <laughs> <laughs> I keep <laughs> saying that now. I'm probably gonna get the soundtrack for Shadows of the Dead. What's some weird freaking name? Fleming? I have look like Ian Fleming. We gotta make James Bond. He sucks, Dick. <laughs> what? <laughs> Let's not get into this. <laughs> Anyways. No, actually he doesn't. I just never really can. Interesting characters. Really odd at some times, and they're kind of... Creeps the hell out of me. I think it would be good for one of your drunk playthroughs. <laughs> <laughs> you may scream a lot. Take a <laughs> Take a shot every time you get stuck in darkness. Take a shot, ev- oh. take a shot every time there's a dig, dig joke. You were going to be drunk in like two minutes. <laughs> 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 it's really the only thing they talk about. You'd be drunk in two minutes, passed out in two and a half. <laughs> okay. Final verdict? Um, so... Decent? Uh... uh average, def- needs definite a pr- average needs a price drop. Definite rent. Yeah. Definite rent. I'm um, sure you can beat this game within a... <laughs> Two-day rental, max. Yeah, we- yeah without... You could you, you could you it. could easily one one session this game. Yeah. We could have beat it tonight know. if we could have. Yeah. yeah. But somebody kept falling asleep. <laughs> hey, that's not my fault. Uh, I I always have to play through the whole game. My ass hurts at the end. <laughs> well, then move around. <laughs> I do. Okay. My knee really hurts. <laughs> oh. Okay. So are we done talking about shadows of the dam? Yeah. Yep. Okay. So. I think we're uh, done. Whoa! Is there anything? Just this is like open session. Guys, anything you guys want to talk about? Any gaming news? Oh. I can't wait for Mass Effect. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Or Skyrim or Uncharted 3. Uncharted. What? Or Diablo 3. That's anticipated. Not going to come out for years. Shut up. Yes, it will. The, the beta is supposed to come out soon, isn't it? Yep. For Diablo 3? I still haven't played StarCraft 2. <laughs> Your computer won't be able to run that. It ran it before. Oh, no. It ran the beta. That's mm-hmm. the beta, dude. Yeah, same thing. Really. Still ran the beta. Okay, that's true. Okay, um, yeah. Do you guys want to talk about our most anticipated games of 2011? Yeah, sure. Why not? Okay, um, who wants to start? Dead Wars 2, Dead Island. I knew you were gonna say Dead Island. I love Dead Island. It's so awesome. And the Old Republic probably, but I don't know. I'll probably get Guild Wars 2 first. Is Old because Republic gonna be pay to play? Yes. Yes. I might have to. I'm gonna get Guild Wars 2 because I just love Guild Wars 1. I don't Star know. If, Star Wars. I don't know if Guild Wars 2 is gonna be out this year. They keep on saying, but they have yet to yeah, release the beta and everything. Sh- I think it's gonna be a 2012 game. Plus, with the fact that the Old Republic is still saying that they're definitely out in 2011, I don't think they're gonna try and compete with the Old Republic. They're gonna wait for a little bit and then they're gonna come out. Dan, saying I think you forgot something. What? Bioshock. That's next year. Is it? Yeah. yeah. When does yeah. it come That's out? next year. I don't think they've they've only announced 2012. They haven't announced yeah. anything else. That's just like... That's just... I don't know. They have a Mass Effect date, right? Is it March 6th or something like that? Mass Effect? Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's March 6th. 2012. Yes. November's gonna hurt me. November's gonna suck. November, what? I... That's got Skyrim. That's got Uncharted. What else does that have? Uh, Battlefield 3, Modern Warfare 3. Uh, uh, Battlefield 3. Not the world Those last two are nothing I'm to only me. interested in Uncharted 3, Skyrim. You're gonna get something. Uh, Skyrim. Maybe a bit later. I'm more of a Morrowind fan, and Oblivion was actually a very big disappointment. I actually went back to playing Oblivion to see why I thought so, and... It's just a problem with... There's, just, there's not as many choices in Oblivion. It's not so much choices, it's the idea that 
what Morrowind got right was the fact that you ha you're trying to do a story, but you're also trying to make sure that you have this open world experience where you can explore. Morrowind understood that actually within its main story to encourage you and to do things in little arcs. Well, Oblivion throws you in immediately, and now you get this kind of unrealistic part where you have all these Oblivion gates up, yet you decide you're going to go do a random quest for one guy to get rid of rats instead of trying to save the world. And I'm wondering what how that's going to work with Skyrim when you have all these dragons around, but you decide that you're just going to go clear out a cave <laughs> instead of saving the city from Why being burned Why fight dragons down. when I can deliver some old lady's bread? The cool thing I like about the dragons is that they are scripted in, into the actual game. They're just randomly there, so they do whatever they want, really. That, I definitely think that that, that is might, interesting in its own it's way. It's interesting, but it might be a problem. It's yeah. going to be a problem in its own Right now they're saying because they, they're trying to get script bugs out because they've had around seven dragons come at a player at once. So they have to make sure that's not <laughs> going to happen. <laughs> and, oh, what the fuck? Walk into dragons. like a building and there's like 19 dragons inside. Just I also think that they definitely brah. have to have... You want like a horse stable that's just full of <laughs> dragons? Oh, I, I, that was another thing I liked about Morrowind. There was no like... The only fast travel were at the fast travel stations. Yeah. Because you can just be like, I want to go to this town. And that encouraged you to explore. And you to would, actually find and stuff. And like every time you played the game, depending on who you were, you would find different stuff you didn't find ever before. Yeah. Because there was a time that I got to I got to like level 40 something, and then I just skipped to the end of the main quest, and I just went into the final boss place, tried to kill him, which is really hard without the items you get to beat him. Yeah. And I still got him. And then it was like... You have destroyed the storyline. Like, oh, okay, that was the thing I didn't like about Morrowind, though. If you killed one of the main characters, they weren't tagged as essential, like in Oblivion. Yeah. So they would die, and it's that would destroy I, the quest line. I actually, because you can reload. You can reload. It's it. gonna warn you. I o I found it more annoying in Oblivion, where you go and kill a guy, and he just says he's unconscious, and you go, oh great. I want to run around the city and goof off for a bit, but this guy in about ten minutes is gonna be stabbing my ass because he's woken up and he ran across the entire city to fight me again. Well, yeah, but if you if you just block and yield, he'll be like, okay, thanks. But it's more the idea that if you want to goof off and decide you're going to go after everyone try and kill them, which is what I did sometimes in Morrowind. I have saves where I understand that I've screwed up everything, but I'm allowed to do that. It's not going to be that they randomly come back again because I'm not supposed to kill them. I'm going to get the game from my computer. <laughs> I like this. I'm not a huge. It's well, I, and then fantasy. I like Morrowind more than Oblivion because, like, there were way more choices for like everything. So it's, it's a like, mo it's a more interesting world. They did a much better. It's your choices in Oblivion are light or heavy, where in Morrowind they had medium in there. <laughs> what? Nothing. Yeah. Video games. Video games. We're you can add input. We can talk I, about something you like. I've tried like four times. I get cut up for you every time. Yeah. <laughs> you literally <laughs> interrupt everyone. Not everyone. Uh, you've interrupted everyone here so far. So? Then I'm three for three. <laughs> now I just have to interrupt myself. Shit, this podcast never been to end. <laughs> we <laughs> should end it. I will end up with... We, we touched like... One game. It's just an type of like more than oblivion. Okay. Which really is how many years? Jedi ago? most anticipated games. Quick, go. Um, for okay, four is a four. Batman Arkham City, Battlefield Three, pumped for um, and Catherine actually kind of pumped to play that game. Comes out in a couple weeks. Lemon King. Ari. Uncharted 3? I'm looking at Uncharted 3. All the other games I'm really interested in are coming out in 2012. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess. Um, There's the older public. I'm waiting a bit to see what the subscription's going to be. It's probably going to be around $15. If it's I'm ridiculously high. Sure. I can't. Yeah. 15. That's less like World yeah. of Warcraft. Buddy. I can't really yeah, say can't anything until they actually announce that it's coming out. They keep on saying it's 2011, but they still don't have an exact date. So the only guaranteed game I'm getting in the rest of this year is Uncharted 3. Yes. You're not going to get Dead, dead Island with us? It you'll get, you'll get Dead Island. So much. Dead you'll Island. get Dead Island. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Arclight, go. 
See, this is where you can actually talk. Yeah, I know, but people. I kind of already put my input. But, well, okay, I'll go again. You're all going to interrupt me, though. <laughs> I wasn't planning on to. Maybe yeah, yeah. Jedi might. Okay, whatever. Well, so Mass Effect... Oh, technically it's 2012. Um, but, yeah. So, so Spider-Man <laughs> Shadow Dimensions is pretty fun. <laughs> that hasn't come out yet. Fuck. I mean, it has come out yet. <laughs> Fuck! Okay. <laughs> Okay, never mind. Okay, I'll, I'll let you finish. Okay, I'm... Uh, fuck. <laughs> so yeah, Skyrim. Like, I love... I spend so much time in those games, so like... I will start a file, I will play it for an hour, and I'll start something new. Because I just like the different choices. Because I can, be, like, I can be anything I want to be. I could like, run around not, stealing I'm books. Not, hmm? I could run around just stealing <laughs> books and not do any of the quests. I'm a librarian. Yeah, and I could just hoard books in my house and be a librarian. That'd be lame. I could throw books at people. That'd be... Eh, it does less one lame. damage. Coming a book slayer. <laughs> um, I'm still waiting for Half-Life 2 Episode 3. Never gonna come uh, out. It's never, never, come never, out. never coming out. It's coming out. Not anytime soon. Or this year. It hasn't been announced. Basically focus on one game. Yeah, Valve focuses on one game, makes it perfect, and then moves like on. Portal. Portal 2, and then they're doing Dota 2. Portal 2 and Dota 2. Amazing. I'm really looking forward to Dota 2. They haven't shown any updates for it, though. They've so shown a couple it's pictures. It's not going to be coming out this year, I doubt it. It's not going to be coming out for a couple years, likely. Yeah. I'm looking forward to it, though. We're most likely never going to get an episode 3. We're just going to Half-Life 3. Probably. If you do have to. I doubt they're even going to try and do this. They're def it's their flagship title, so... Yeah. So They're just waiting. Them. It's the one that... The problem is, is that they always have to make sure that they're innovating, so it's the best thing. So they might try all these test things. With if they throw the portal stuff. gun into it, my the companion cube comes out of nowhere. Despite <laughs> 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 hello, sir. I am going to help you. Despite <laughs> the fact that they've connected those <laughs> two <laughs> franchises, I really don't think that they should do much crossover. You're gonna have the Borealis. That with the aperture science, but I really don't think that you should get into any more of aperture that. science. I don't think you should start doing portal guns and all that stuff in Half Life. Yeah, that'd be kind of cool. The gravity gun is kind of the oh, tool. Yeah. So if you just find new ways of how to use it. Yeah, with portals. <laughs> you bring gravity through portals. <laughs> you just come back. Once you bring portals into oh, wow. Half Life, then you've made it too similar to Portal. It's a itself. it's a it's a first person shooter with actual guns in Portal. Okay. <laughs> anyway, uh, I think that there's a couple PS3 games on. I have them in my phone. <laughs> uh, gameplay phone. Game. Okay, like new games or just uh, games they're coming out. Play? I actually am interested in Connect. There's a game coming out. It's called Steel Battalion Heavy Armor. Um, mm -hmm. it that game? It no. The other one came out for original Xbox, okay. and it only came bundled with like these special joysticks because there are just so many goddamn buttons to press. Oh, okay. But they're gonna bundle it with Connect, so maybe there's gonna be like some cool like entry thing with like your hands, which it's probably just gonna be like an electronic hive and you touch. I would. That would be really neat. Um, no, no, no Lord of the Rings: War of the North. That's the one. That might be. It'll either be really good or terrible, and I will cry and hate Lord of the Rings forever for it. It's the same guys who made Third Age, the Dark Alliance games, if I believe. Woo! Okay. I love those games. I'm buying it then, because I love those games. I hope it's good. If it's well done, I'm going to run wherever they are, and I'm going to hug them. <laughs> Creepy. Um, there are three other ones. I think they're only for PS3. They're called Cursed Crusade and Dragon's Dogma. Dragon's Dogma is the only thing that's coming out for it. It's not coming out for a while, I don't think, because it's been, like, touched on a little bit. I like all its initials are DD. Yeah, the same as, like, Dungeons and Dragons. Dungeons and Dragons is D and D. It's D and D. D and D. <laughs> Idiots. <laughs> no, it's so Idiot. Get it right. It's only Jedi. I really want to play that History Channel Great Battle Medieval. <laughs> <laughs> That's so 60 bucks. I think that was in your magazine. It got four. Is it? That's not that bad. I feel like it would be worse. It's a History Channel game. These things are awful. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's well done. I want a new Kingdom got, Under probably Fire probably got the game. same as, as Duke Nukem forever. I want Kingdom Under yeah, Fire to go back to their like, strategy. Huh? 
Kingdom Under Fire? Anyone? Nope. nope. I nope. tried that game. Which Sucked. one? You probably played the RTS one. The one it added cards. <laughs> I didn't that's, know how to. I didn't that's know, not the one. I didn't know how to summon them, so I that's stopped. That's the terrible one. <laughs> I returned it the same day I got and got a different game. You bought it? No, no. Like I rented it, and I was like, I don't know how to play this game. I want a different game. They're like, okay. Ruined demo. That was for GameCube though. <laughs> yes, that is why it was terrible. Fuck. Super Mario Strikers? Are you kidding me? No, GameCube had good games. GameCube was fucking awesome. Not. Am I getting into this talk right now? Shitty no, let's not get into this talk right now. We need to wrap it up. We're only an hour and a half. Me too. That's a long time. Jam Bomb Cat is almost three hours. I don't it, care. They, don't. This is our had, first episode. This is, this is first. us. Jam <laughs> Bomb Cat had one that was over five hours. No, around five hours. This is yeah, ah, it's really sorry, goddamn three. warm in your house, though. <laughs> Turn the fan on more. The fan is on more, and it's going right at me, and only me, and I'm <laughs> still warm. I don't know what you guys are feeling over there, but... I'm fine. I'm alright. I'm... I live in a house that's very air-conditioned, so whenever I go anywhere else, it's like, dear God. <laughs> well, too bad, you get no wind. <laughs> <laughs> Next time, my house. No, next time it's still my house. Why? Because this is where it's going to be. We have set a tradition of being spot. on the bed. This is the spot. This is the tradition. Plus, your house get interrupted more than my house. This is valid. Yeah, your family That's is true. very nice to interrupt them. You just wait till they go to the lake. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're, going, we're trying to do this weekly, Luke. Yeah, they go to the weekly. lake like weekly. They weekly go to the lake. What, what days do they go to the lake? On the weekends? Yeah. Yeah, see, the weekends we usually go out. Fuck going out. I'm not. Why go out when we can podcast? <laughs> oh my gosh. We're done. Okay, yeah, <laughs> so we're going to try and get this on iTunes. So if you listen to this on iTunes, it's awesome. Um, if not, just listen to it on Podbean. Podbean will be on there and it'll be on our YouTube channel. So always dancing and maybe spinning jumbo bat. But for sure, always dancing. So is spinning jumbo bat like the. The brand name, or is that the YouTube name? I keep forgetting. That's the YouTube name. Well, okay, that's the same thing, but I mean, is that, like, the username, or, like, the... That's, the, that's like, the channel name, Spinning okay, Jumbo yeah. Bat, all one word. Yeah, well, I know, I helped make it, but I haven't done anything to yeah, it for, like, months. And you keep saying, I'm going to record, and you don't, but yeah, anyways... I don't so know what to record. I need games. You have a whole stack of games in your room. This is true, but they're old. They're, like, Titan Quest, and... That's fine. Record them. Get yeah, I think it's time to put it under wraps. Okay, yeah. I like this idea. Let's do that. Get a dab on HGPDR. But yeah, okay, so this was the Power Fruit Podcast. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm pretty sure you guys probably listened to this full hour and a half. Or I know you did. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking to you. Watch the people unsubscribe. Watch, watch, watch your numbers just go down because of the stupid <laughs> Negative 19 views. <laughs> and then, then, then they'll be caught. Hey, then they'll be why comments. is it always my fault? There'll be comments saying, I stopped watching after the first five minutes of hearing that guy interrupt everyone. <laughs> it's not always my fault. I'm, I'm not pointing at the I'm just looking at you. Let's cut out. Okay, um, do you want to do any like, sign outs from everyone or just cut it? I'm always dancing. I'm Jedi Pointer. Lamakin. Arc light. Interrupter. No. And route.